to show you how Tank and I have been getting started on place. You see, when I went over to this mat, he laid down on it. If he were to not lay down, I would just go ahead and cue the down. But he went ahead and did it on his own. So what I'm doing now is I am feeding him multiple treats while he holds the position on the mat. I'm trying to aim them so that he doesn't have to get up to reach them. They're just right in front of his face. Free! After I've fed him several treats, I'm going to release him with our release cue. And then I'm going to see what he does. I'm gonna stand right next to the mat. Good job. So I am clicking for that moment that he laid down on the mat. What I wanna see before I add in our place cue is that he is going to this mat and laying down on his own without me having to say down. And I wanna see him doing that over and over again. Free. As soon as he eats that treat, Great, so now I know I'm ready to add in the place cue because he is going back to the mat reliably. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to say place after he eats the treat for being released. That's gonna be right before I think he's gonna go back to the mat. Free. Place. So now I am pairing that word place with his behavior of going to the mat. You notice I'm not moving right now. I'm trying to make this as easy as possible for him to stay on that mat until released. Free. Place. Free. And that one made him get up. That placement of the treat is important. Free. Place. 